care about this boy, OG. I'm out here again. This dailies. So I'm gonna show two laps of what I see while I'm in the car. Just so you can see how hectic I really how I see what I see. And then we'll after the two laps we'll show the full race in cinematic view and all that, like I like to do. But when I'm racing, this is what I see. This is how I start. This is what I see. This is what's going on. Those first two laps, which is very crucial. I've been getting to start in the middle of the pack like I like. I, I really can start in the front if I press it a little bit more, but that's not always good. I can start in the middle of the pack because I'm easily going to make up a couple of spots instantly. I already know that. That ran to the back. <coughs> I should have got out of him quicker. <coughs> I try to push him up there. People don't. That's Chris. Fucking idiot. He think I'm bumping him. I bumped him so we could stay up in traffic and leave those guys behind. But he gonna come in here and wreck me. Fucking crazy. I got him right here. It's nothing, 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 nothing. Come on, I got him. It's clean pass. It's that first lap, first lap bullshit. People were smart. It was getting in line. Follow around the car. Find you stay as close as you can. <coughs> and you can pull away. <coughs> when you side by side and bump with somebody. Sorry, y'all. You lose a gang, gang, gang of time. Lots of time. So I'm, I'm on a, I'm on the go all the way. Uh, no pit stop. Racing mediums are really set to only go eight laps, most cars, max. So if you can press out, you know, these 12 laps, you, you, you just accomplishment in itself. So that's what mostly all the YouTubers are doing these days with this particular race this week. This is how they're milking it. I'm going to get on board. So here we go. So you see that idiot Chris is coming to cheap on you. What he got was a three second penalty. Basically gonna take him out the race. He not, unless, unless he was in first or something like that. But I, I'm just gonna stay calm. I'm not gonna let that get me down. Look how he's driving. Don't make no sense. I got the line right here. He's still gonna want to bump me. It's fine. So we're gonna go in and let that play through. I just wanted to let you know that when you do stupid shit like that, you are penalized. And if you cut these corners, get both tires off the track, you penalize. It is what it is. But that three seconds was to choke him up. So we're going to, this is the end of the second lap. I just want you to see what I see from in the car. Um, the screen I look at, now we're going to go ahead and run the full race. I hope you guys enjoy it. Just a little look and see what I, what I see, what I feel, how I race it. Let's go get it.
CSC the tire check. The top five cars that we got on the, the um, race of the media. So many of these guys are trying to go the whole race. Plain and simple. That's all you get. That's what you do in the front. That's what the YouTubers do. That's what I'm doing now. So I said, I'm after that shit. So this is what, look at the tires right there. That's what I'm putting on the screen. So you can see in the bottom left hand corner. You can see that's what that screen was up for. Let's get it. Should have pressed a little bit more, I think. But when you press 
trying to accomplish a specific strategy, you can't get away from it. So I'm just going to stay on the specific side. Clock the same amount of times over and over and over. And see why I get Because these, these guys are buying their tires up a little bit in front of me, and that's not what I'm trying to do. I'm trying to get a podium finish on the fourth, looking really good right now. So the guy behind me, on the same strategy as me, he don't wear his tires up. But that's how, you, you know, how smooth you are, uh, how your braking is, how you got your car, brake miles set up, things like that. So, it could, a lot of things can happen. Let's go get it. Tires, you know, you might have a chance to go without a pit stop. Most people can't. It's hard. You know, it's really hard. Uh, the car that's in first place is not the same car as me. If I could have caught up to him at the beginning of the race, we would have had a race. Actually, I got better tires than him, but I, I just can't close the gap to get up there to him. It's, that has to happen early, and uh, within two laps, you be right up there with him. I was up there, but man, there's a difficulty. It is what it is. I wreck, I bump. <coughs> but these tires is crucial. That's why we're going to want second place right now. Uh, all I'm trying to do is hope that something happens up there. So let's go.
I mean, yeah, I don't know if y'all noticed, but this is, I'm racing real people from all over the world. I'm not talking to none of these guys. None of these guys are my friends. Every, some of these guys I race again are uh, YouTubers. They're streaming live, showing their they daily races. Other guys out there racing the league like me and just trying to keep your skills up. So this is uh, not easy to get a podium finish out there. Problem a couple of weeks ago was I kept qualifying in the back of the pack, and in the back is where it's, it's, it's messy. At. It's just messy. As long as I can keep qualifying somewhere, six, seven, or above, I, I usually do pretty good. So this your boy out here. weighs a lot more and the weight transfer does funny things to the car. Uh, if he had kept the tires on the track, probably wouldn't have went through what he's going to go through. But uh, it, it is what it is, you know. It happens. Or, you know, I was waiting on something to happen. I was there to take advantage of it. It is what it is. Everybody's tires is about the same. His tires, the guy that was in second back there, Oh, my beard was actually better. It's still better. Got more tread. But because the way his car handles, period, it's even more unstable when the tires get loose like that. So, it is. Let's go, y'all. 